Hi, I'm Rob Holmes. Today's Monday, and the biggest news today is that Spike Lee's new trailer just dropped, and it's a doozy. Uh, the movie is called The Five Bloods. No, it's not about gangs in L.A. It's a little bit overdone. Another topic that's been overdone, but I think is going to really be well, uh, well told by Spike, because it's from an African-American perspective, which is the Vietnam War. Uh, the story stars some of my favorite actors. Delroy Lindo, one of my all-time favorites. And uh, Clark Peters and Isaiah Whitmore are two guys I love from The Wire, and you probably do too, one of the greatest shows of all time. They play Vietnam vets who go back to Vietnam to find some treasure that they buried back during the war. Anyway, the, um, <clears throat> the movie is told, a lot of it, in flashback. The flashbacks star their, their um, dead squadron leader, played by Chadwick Boseman. Anyway, it just looks phenomenal. Music's done by Terrence Blanchard, Spike's normal guy. It just looks really good. Anyway, uh, check out the trailer. I might leave a link uh, somewhere on this, uh, on this page. All right, now let's get to our reading for the day. The 637 best things anyone ever said. Number 364. This is Somerset Maram, 1874 to 1965. I've always been interested in people, but I've never liked them. I'm sure some of you guys can relate to that. 365. From the Goon Show. I don't know what the Goon Show is. Not the Gong Show. The Goon Show. Are you going to come quietly? Or do I have to use earplugs? <laughs> Bertrand Russell, who's always good for a uh, smart, introspective type of comment, and this is no exception, 366. One of the symptoms of an approaching nervous breakdown is the belief that one's work is terribly important. H.H. <laughs> H. Monroe, 367. A little inaccuracy sometimes saves a ton of explanation. A little inaccuracy sometimes saves a ton of explanation. If you can figure out what that means, write it in the bottom here, because I'm not sure exactly if I pick that up, if you get my drift. 368, J.D. Salinger. we got a pair of J.D. Salingers here. Uh, 368, it's really hard to be roommates with people if your suitcases are much better than theirs. Oh, I get it. I have Louis Vuitton and you don't. Sorry, J.D. 369. J.D. Salinger again. Take most people. They're crazy about cars. I'd rather have a goddamn horse. A horse is at least human, for God's sake. Yeah, you're the guy with the better luggage? On a horse? All right, all right. 370. This will be the last one for the day. Jean-Paul Sartre. 1905 to 1980, 3.70. Three o'clock is always too late or too early for anything you want to do. I'd say yes, except, except at my favorite bar, Killer Shrimp. Happy hour starts at three o'clock sharp. Of course, I can't use present tense. It started at three o'clock sharp. If they reopen, I'm, I'm hoping that, uh, that that still happens. Anyway, I love all you guys. I'm hoping you have a very nice Monday. And I'll see you tomorrow.